Hi guys, welcome to another video. We're gonna talk about the shooting line and how many wraps you have. This is just a short gun. 99.9% of our guns are set up standard with a single wrap. Now remember the wrap goes from the back of the shaft to the muzzle, back to the line release, back to the muzzle. So effectively, your range of the gun is the length of the barrel, plus the splear, plus three lines. So with a roller and double wrap, you've actually got five strands. So your range is five barrel lengths, plus the barrel, plus the spear. So we roughly work it out at about seven times the barrel length. So in this case, if this was a roller, 500, 500 times seven, three and a half meters of range. A lot of times that's too much line in the water. If you're hunting reef fish in case, for instance, you often don't have enough time to pull the gun back and get to your shaft. That means your fish can drag that shaft way back into the cave and get well tangled. Guys that have more than one gun, most of them have a dedicated gun for cave shooting. A good idea is to set your shooting line up so it only attached to the back of the spear and to the muzzle. In this case, you're shooting very close up in a cave the moment you fire that, the spear can still go the spear length plus the barrel length. You have immediate ability to hold tension on that fish to prevent it from going too deep. So this would be a setup simply for diving in caves where you're shooting very close up. Generally, the guys would only have a single band on that because you're shooting extremely close. You don't want that shaft to bury itself on the rocks with multiple bands. And short line just gives you much more control of that fish. I hope that video helps those who want to shoot fish in caves. Stand by for the next. <music>